Welcome back everyone, it's Abdallah here with another exciting episode of Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu and Pokemon Let's Go Eevee Master Trainer Battles. We are on our way to becoming the Grand Master by going through every single Pokemon and beating the Master Trainer. Today is all about that sweet Pokemon number 25 and 26, Pikachu and Raichu. Now, a lot of you guys might be saying, alright, well, the Pikachu Master Trainer is relatively easy because I've got Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu. And I've got the best move set for Pikachu, so therefore it's so easy. But what we're gonna be doing is we're gonna be using a random uh, trained level 100 Pikachu in the wild in order to beat all these ones. So that those of you guys who are on Pokemon Let's Go Eevee, you can have an easier time doing it. So, in case you guys have not seen our previous episode where we went through. Who did we go through? Oh, hey, there's a Pikachu. Um. Who do we do? I'm like, I'm blanking here. We're doing so many of these episodes. Go watch the previous episode nonetheless. We're doing all of these guys. Every single Pokemon up to this point has been done. Oh yeah, Ekans. Oko Ekans. We totally knocked out Oko Ekans. That was great. Hey, that's a Butterfree. That's pretty cool. Anyway, so we're going to head on over. I'll show you guys the locations of all these Master Trainers and we're going to do you one solid and we're going to beat them and show you guys exactly what is going on in order to beat them. So, let's take a look at our brand new Pikachu. This is not our Pikachu that we've been using with the 426 HP and maxed out stats. No. This is just a regular old Pikachu. Let's see how we do on this one. This is a, uh, a highly curious Pikachu. We can see that we put a little bit of candy into special attack. It doesn't matter. We're gonna say that we put no candy in there because we're not even gonna be using the special attack stat. All you need. Uh, ooh, wow, this is an interesting one. Uh, I don't know if we're gonna need Toxic. <clears throat> we're gonna try without Toxic. We're gonna try with just straight up Dig. Because the Pikachu Master Trainer only has a moveset of Slam, Toxic, Substitute, and Reflect. So, maybe we might need Toxic? Uh, yeah, you know what, let's, let's give it Toxic just for the heck of it. Alright, fine. We'll Toxic stall it. All right, guys, you convinced me. We're toxic stalling every Pokemon, pretty much. And that's uh, exactly how we're going to do it. But hey, you know what? As long as you win and get that title, am I right? So here goes a Pikachu. Uh, we're going to learn this really quick. And I don't necessarily need Quick Attack. I mean, Quick Attack's great and all, but it's only 40 base power. It's got to go. It's not doing much for us. So let's take a look. And let's see how we can win this one. So I'm really hoping that uh, the Master Trainer... I've already beaten this Master Trainer with our Pikachu our partner Pikachu after the Elite Four. So I'm not really worried about whether or not we're gonna do it. I know we can do it. But I'm worried about this wild Pokemon, this wild Pikachu that we have over here, simply because the only move that uh, Ikue has right over here to attack us with is going to be Toxic Stalling and Slam. Okay, so male Pikachu versus female Pikachu. I'm gonna start off with the Toxic in hopes that it doesn't set up a sub. So I miss the Toxic and I get slammed for it. Well, that's dumb. I missed the Toxic, come on now, and now I'm gonna get slammed again. <laughs> like, what the heck? But you know what, it's fine. It's absolutely fine. We can, you can have this one, Ikue, that's okay. All right, so now I got Toxic. Right when I was gonna do a sub, I get Toxic, great. So that's fine. We're gonna eat that big toxic damage. There's no point in me toxic stalling now because I'm already at the lower health. So I'm gonna try out a dig and I'm gonna see if dig does anything. So we're gonna go underground. Most likely this thing is gonna set up reflect. Or not, that's really good. So you're gonna eat that poison too. I'm gonna do a big hit right now. That's not enough damage. Now the reflect comes. Okay, well, let me see if I can take two turns worth of poison damage, and then I could potentially win. I can possibly take two turns of poison and then win this one. Even if I miss the even if I miss the toxic at the beginning. So here we go. All I have to do is take this one turn of toxic, and then I'm gonna win. So here comes a slam. Oh wow, look at that poison with nine HP left. Look at your poison. Whoop. And then here we go. The only thing, yeah, this is win condition. We won. So there we go. Boom, big KO. We're able to do it with this move set of Toxic Dig 
sub and protect. We didn't even need sub and protect as long as you got the toxic off. So that's really easy. I mean, I don't necessarily think you need to have a level 100 Pikachu in order to do this one. Oh wow, your Pikachu is way stronger than I thought. We should have another battle sometime since we both love Pikachu so much. So we've done that one with our partner Pokemon, so it's not going to give us the little flavor text. So don't even worry about it. Okay, so let's get out of this forest now that we showed you guys how to do that one. That was relatively easy. I thought we'd struggle a little bit because that's, you know, that's such a, a prominent name. You know, Ikue and um, just Pikachu. I thought it'd be like a little bit harder, but Pikachu has access to Dig and therefore you can completely Toxic Stall and then go from there. So pretty interesting. So now what we're going to do is we're going to head on over to Lavender Town's Pokemon Tower. And we're going to evolve our Pikachu into a level 100 Raichu. Now, with that being said, you can absolutely trade up your Raichu that's level 100. Well, no, I would... Never mind. Don't do that. Trade up a regular old Raichu that you may have caught and evolved. And trade that over to the, uh, to the Alolan guy. And you can have an Alolan Raichu with Stab Psychic. That could totally help out. But we're not going to do that this time around. Uh, let's go over to Power Up Pocket. Let's do uh, Thunderstone. Let's evolve our... Um, our Pikachu, and let's go from there. So Pikachu's evolving with the help of this. It's our male Pikachu looking really cool. Uh, I like it. I like it a lot. So this next one, I think we're going to use the same moveset. Toxic, Dig, Sub, Protect in order to knock out Raichu. Raichu is going to be a little bit harder and a little bit more annoying because Raichu has access to the move Double Team. And Double Team is not going to help us out at all, especially if we somehow miss due to the Double Team hit. So it wants to learn Thunder Punch. We don't necessarily need it. So we're going to go from there. So now, again, this is showing you guys that you can do it with a Pikachu without any candy investment. So we're all set with that. All right, let's fly over to Lavender and let's see what's going on. And let's go beat this up. Pikachu's pouting? Yeah, you're pouting because what? I evolved another Pikachu in front of you? Is that rude? I don't know. Pikachu's like, how could you? Right in front of me. Come on, who wouldn't want a Raichu riding on their shoulder? I think that would be really cute. Okay, so here we are in Lavender Town. This is where you're going to find the Raichu Master Trainer. And like I said earlier, if you have an Alolan Raichu, you may have a more advantage because you can use same type attack bonus on Psychic and end up winning or doing a lot more uh, damage. So that's pretty cool. All right, here we go. We are moving along. Come on, Pikachu, let's go. All right, so I'm looking for a Raichu Master Trainer. Any of you guys here? Cubone, no thanks. Sorry, little dude. As much as I like Cubone, I don't think so. Not today. Raichu. That's a Lapras Master Trainer. All right, we're going to keep that in mind when we're ready for the Lapras episode. We gotta raise up a Lapras. It's gonna be a little while, so... Oh, oh, that's a Hypno. Dang it, that's a Hypno Master Trainer. Get out of here, dude. Looking for Raichu. Alright, well, we're kind of looking around here. I don't need any healing. Raichu! I'm not gonna write you a love song. Where are you? Alright, you gotta be over here. There you are. Got it. Your beloved Raichu. Are you visiting him? Alright. I'm the Raichu master. My goal is to find the ultimate Raichu. Hey, your Raichu looks pretty strong. Can you battle with mine? Yeah, sure. Okay, so here we go. I didn't show you the stats of my Raichu, but I don't think that we are going to need stats at all for this one. I mean, the only stat that matters is speed stat. And I got dig, so I can dig if I wanted to. So Raichu, enemy Raichu's attacks are going to be headbutt, double team, hyper beam. So I can eat a hyper beam right off the bat and just lose. But uh, I want to make sure that we get this big, um, big Toxic off. Let's see what happens. So there's that double team. Great. I got to get this Toxic on him. Or else we're going to be stuck. Oh, gosh. I missed it right off the bat. Great. Oh, yuck. That's a level 2 evasion. Oh, no. Woo! Level 2 evasion. Here we go. And I missed the Toxic again. Yes. GG's, dude. I'm about to give up on this one. Double team again. I could have had at least three turns of Toxic happening here, guys. Look at that. This is trash. I quit. Not worth it. GG's, lady. Let's try again without evasion right off the bat. I just need to nail a Toxic.
Okay, last Charlotte. Oh, come on. Come on, Raichu. Okay, there's that double- that's fine. You know what? Double team all you want. I just need to get that one Toxic off on ya. Thank you, and now we win. We proceed to win. You can double team all you want. Feel free. I'm just gonna stall out over here. Get to plus six evasion. I don't need to even touch you with a dig. I'm- the reason why I'm going to dig is to stall out one turn. So what we're gonna do right now is I'm gonna sub. He's going for headbutt. Okay, okay. Ouch, that hurt a lot. I think Hyper Beam would have hurt a lot more. That probably would have okoed me. So, in hindsight, what I should have done was probably use Protect on that one, just to make sure I get a free turn. I thought they were going to keep on going with, um, with double teams, but that's okay. You know what? We're fine. Here's a big Hyper Beam. Oh, that didn't work because I protected. Okay, okay. Now this is going to be interesting. Uh, I can either protect or I can go for another sub and then go for a dig. Who's faster? I'm gonna go for sub right now because I know he's gonna break it. Holy moly. So it's good that I went for sub because he was gonna break and I'll put up another one, which is fine. So he's got one turn. Ooh, this is gonna be really tough. I better get underground. Yeah, you know what? I think I won this one. This one's easy. Here we go. Dig. We're in. All you're doing is recharging. I'm gonna dig underground. You're gonna take that poison damage. And then I'm gonna emerge doing damage. And knocking you out in the process. So, this is GG's. Good job. Pokeball drop. We're done. Thank you. Nice knowing you. Substitute totally helped out here. Protect was also really good. Oh my! Oh yeah, that's right. You had the... You had the evasion, so I missed the dig. That's cool. Doesn't matter. <laughs> I was like a split second like oh gosh really I'm gonna eat a hyper beam but no we had substitute up so it didn't matter anyway the stat strength is the real deal okay so now you guys know how to do this one your Raichu is way stronger than I thought we are the Raichu master that's right okay so that was really cool we got the Raichu master and now uh, oh ooh, is there an item over there Pikachu are you telling me there's an item here oh a PP up wow that was really good dude good job buddy Thank you, thank you. I needed that. I wish it was a rare candy though, but either way. <laughs> All right, so that's great. Our next episode is going to be a Sand Slash episode. A Sand Shrew and Sand Slash episode, meaning we're gonna go through and choose these characters, raise them up, go over their competitive moveset in order to beat our final bosses of these master trainers. It's gonna be a really good one. So make sure you guys don't miss it, right? You guys are all subscribed, do that. Answer our community question of the day. Which nature and moveset did you guys use to beat this master trainer? I feel I feel that you can do it with like, oh my gosh, a level 70-ish, maybe like an 80 Raichu, because we didn't really need anything. We honestly didn't. We just needed to ensure, can I warp to the bottom at the top here? Is there a little warp panel for me? Uh, you're the weeping bell. Oh, that's pretty cool. Oh, there's nothing you can do over here. Interesting. I never came back here after the after beating it. Anyway, so what I was saying was it didn't matter because I didn't even use dig against him. So if you think about it, you could probably end up doing that with a with a Raichu that as long as it can take a headbutt or a potential hyper beam, man. You got to be really lucky if you're going to try to take a hyper beam on that thing, man. No way. No way, dude. Hyper beam. All right, so I think I'm gonna end it over here. I don't necessarily need to walk all the way down, but I'm kind of here anyway, so might as well, right? Get me out of this forsaken place! Help! These copy pastas are scary. They're more like creepy pastas, am I right? Anyway, here we go, the last room. We get out of this scary zone. Don't have to worry about haunters or anything like that. But I, I can't wait for that one episode of showing off the Gengar and the haunter and everything like that. That's gonna be really fun, so. Okay, ladies and gents, that's going to be it for our episode right outside of Pokemon Tower. We beat it. We beat Raichu. We beat the Pikachu one. And we didn't just do it with our partner Pokemon. 
You guys don't need to see me do it with my partner Pokemon. You guys got it. We just showed you guys a random Pikachu that we found. We were able to outmaneuver it with Toxic and Dig and everything like that. It was super fun and easy. So thanks for watching. If you guys enjoyed today's episode, be sure to smash that like button and share the video with a friend. If you guys want to see even more Master Trainer Battles, click right over here to watch the playlist. Newest video on the channel that way. Recommendations there. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you're notified of the latest and greatest Pokemon and Nintendo Switch content. We'll see you on the next one. Take care.